if we look at a an inverter that's rated at let's say a uh, a three kilowatt inverter, um, or let's use as a prime example a three point five kilowatt five kW inverter that's running off of 12 volts DC to make 120 volts AC. If I need one amp of AC, I have to draw 10 amps of DC. If I need 10 amps of AC, I need to draw 100 amps of DC. If I need 20 amps of AC, now I need to draw 200 amps of DC. This 3.5 kilowatt inverter actually provides 30 amps of AC. It's the same, 3.5 kilowatts is really the same as a 30 amp service that you would plug into short power. So at 30 amps, now I'm drawing 300 amps. Off of 12 volt batteries, I'm looking at, at needing probably some function of a thousand amp hours in order to do this for any length of time. But let's look at the comparable case at 144. And let's say, for instance, you saw how it worked out with the 4D 200 amp hour battery. Oops, one zero too many, 200 amp hour battery. Let's see how it works out with the same 4D 200 amp hour battery at 144 DC. First off, if I need from 144 DC to 120 AC. If I need um, one amp of AC, what I need to draw off of 144 DC is nine tenths of an amp. In fact, if I need 10 amps of AC, what I need here is 9 amps. If I need 20 amps of AC, then what I need over here is about 18 amps. If I need 30 amps of AC, what I need over here is about 29 amps. Now these are approximations because they really depend on temperature and everything else. But as you can see, now my 4D 200 amp hour battery pack will last if its Pukert's formula is adjusted at 20 amps. And if I'm running at 30 amps, which is a full um, uh, three and a half kilowatts, I mean running it wide open, I am drawing 29 amps, which allows my 200 amp hour battery pack to be 200 amp hours. And in fact, given that I'm somewhere in the middle of this road, say 18 amps, at 18 amps I can run this battery pack for five hours producing 20 amps of AC before I get to 50% depletion. In the case of a... Now, to use the example of say, because uh, uh, it was brought up by one of our users, an 11,000 BTU air conditioner, which draws 9 amps, 
through our 94% efficient inverter from air packs and we have a 200 amp hour battery pack um, but we only want to go to 50% depletion that leaves us 100 amp hours and 9 amps um, is going to be about 8.2 amps of DC required to make 9 amps of AC. Divide 8.2 into 100 and now you have approximately 12 hours worth of running to 50% depletion which means that this 144 volt DC battery pack at 200 amp hours will run an 11,000 BTU air conditioner from 8 o'clock at night to 8 o'clock in the morning without having any generator running at all. And if that isn't a good reason to go with a hybrid system, nothing is.